There's actually a lot of great opportunities at Maine Med. This is the largest hospital in Maine, and so we get referrals from all over the state. We have a great breadth of cases that fellows can experience here. The goal for an incoming fellow, I think, would just be to, one, learn, you know, clinical infectious diseases, of course, bread and butter ID, but I think also just finding what they're passionate about. What I really liked was how dedicated the staff and the fellows and the attendings were to education. It's a small program and we can give each fellow a very individualized learning experience. You can customize your curriculum based on what you need and your future career goal. We have very specific learning tracks that fellows can choose. It is a clinical track where they can, during their first year, do the kind of traditional ID fellow experience of having a lot of inpatient time. We have the um, addiction medicine track. And then thirdly, we have the hospital epidemiology and antimicrobial stewardship track. I also precept at the Gilman Clinic, which is our integrated HIV hepatitis clinic. And we now have a bridge program there where we do integrated substance use disorder treatment as well. There is an HIV pharmacist, there's a nutritionist, and there's a social worker, um, all in the clinic at the same time as the fellows. They have the benefit of working with other people who will also be providing services for their patients. They are very, very helpful making decisions. You learn a lot from them. Not only the clinical aspect, of, but you learn from the uh, pharmaceutical part. So we have research navigators, which is really unique, I think, to Maine Medical Center, who will actually help fellows you know, start the IRB application, for example, and, you know, help with writing a proposal, but also help with, you know, that poster presentation or help develop that talk. So there's a lot of support. The relationship between the um, ID fellows and the attendings is like a friend and at the same time, a good mentorship. And it's oftentimes the attending plus the fellow kind of going around the hospital and seeing the patients who are in service. We get to know them really well, and I think they get to know us and our styles very well. We're very collegial, so I think bouncing ideas off other people uh, and uh, attendings um, is pretty seamless, I think, pretty easy. I think the camaraderie is great. Um, we, you know, all get along really well, I'd say. It's a pretty easygoing group. The attendings are your family, so you need someone who can support you, who can understand you. There is a lot of work, but there's a lot of time to decompress. A big reason I moved to Maine was for the work-life balance. Life in Portland is awesome. I mean, you can go to the beach any day, go for a hike any day. So, so beautiful. Portland has a lot of beautiful areas you can go out, especially on weekends and, you know, relax. So we have a, a new newborn as well, so my program has been extremely supportive. All of us really appreciate that we need that work-life balance, and I think it's something we all try to practice when we preach. Really. If you're not looking for some place to just feel stressed 100% of the time, this is a great place. <laughs> the moment you get here, you feel like I am at home, and I would say, it's one of my best decisions I made.